Hey guys, welcome to Peace in the Garden. I hope everybody's having a wonderful day. It's nice outside, so I wanted to come out to amend some soil. So I have my little section over here. Here we go. So don't think that if you don't have a house or you don't have a backyard that you can't um, go to your front porch and set up or you can go on your steps and set up. You pretty much can garden anywhere you can to garden if you like. So I am amending my soil because I'm getting ready to plant. Uh, what am I planting today? Some um, onions. Look at those little cute little spring onion things. Oh, people call them different things. I'm just super excited. So I'm going to plant these today so I can do a lot of powdered um, onions and I can also do a lot of dehydrating machine. I have my first dehydrating machine. Yeah! <laughs> I am super excited, guys. So this is what I'm planting right now. Just make sure you kind of follow the instructions on the back. Kind of give you a guide of what you need to do when you're planting. And these are some of my favorite um, fertilizers that I use. Let me flip you around. Worm casting. And this, this bag actually lasts me for the whole year last year. I still have a little bit left, so I'm gonna use that today. I got some bone meal, plant, all-purpose plant food. This is um, slow fertilization. I'm gonna put a little bit in each one. I did that one already. I made a little something, something. It's not, uh... oh wow, it is going out very slow. Okay, that may be something that I might continue to use. So I put some holes in there and I put some of my, let me take this top off so you can see. I have some half milk and half water. Um, milk is really good for the garden. I keep expired milk and I use half milk and half water and I use it for my plants. Okay. Put some bone meal in there. Let me get the soil all ready. Been sitting since last year. Um, I always try to refresh it by adding some amendments in it before I use it again. And worm casting. Okay, so I'm gonna mix it all up real well. I put half of expired milk in the watering can and I fill the other half up with water. Milk is great to use in your garden. It's beneficial to your plants. Milk serve as a fertilizer to help your plants grow nice and strong. It has antifungal and pesticide properties too. It will help with your tomatoes, peppers, and squash plants that suffer from blossom and rot. Now we're going to put in the seeds. Let's go. Cover with soil and then we're going to give it a nice drink of water. Don't forget to put your labels in. Now I'm planting in some kale. Add some leftover. I'm going to use everything I have first. Remember to put your labels in so you can know what you're planting. I have forgotten before, but I learned my lesson. All right, guys, I'm excited. I'm planting something new. This is one of my favorite spots to shop at, Baker's Creek. So this says that it sprouts in five to eight days. A good ideal temperature is 55 to 70. And it says it's frost. Party. So this is good for when it's still in frost. So we're going to plant this today. This is the information on the back. They have a really, really great selection of um, products. I'm not affiliated with them, but if you want to, you know, just call me up. <laughs> okay, so yes, I'm about to plant this now. Let's see how it goes. It looks so pretty. I'm really looking forward to trying. All of my things are pretty much done. Yeah, one, two, three, four, and five. 
This is where these babies will be going. I'm excited to plant these today. Okay, so this is my first time plant. I just want to share what the seeds look like. It look a little bit like kale seeds. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do four in there. Let me put some of these back first. All right, so I decided to do a little bit extra just in case. I'm gonna drop these in here and that's it for the day, guys. I'm gonna water this down and we are done. I'm gonna wipe it like that because I don't have no more seeds and we are out. All right, guys, enjoy. Peace and love. Bye. Before I go, take a look at my little baby's progress.